Oh yeah. We're back. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm worried. Oh, you mean that? And welcome, my name is Shushi Anime, and welcome back to. Kimeto to Kanoso to Kanoso no Koi. Oh, you, me, and her. Uh, a love story, and. We just got our head smashed in in the last part. Sorry about the long delay. I am trying to get back to a normal pace once again. I am back in the UK. I'm trying to get used to co um, cohabitating with my brother again. We are sharing in the same room, so. Getting recordings in a bit awkward, but I'll try my best. So anyway, without any further ado, you give me a shortcut. It's time to die. Oh boy. All right, Miyuki hangs her head. <laughs> oh, I will. I can't have an aid as you No, I won't. No, I will not kiss you. You're crazy. No, I won't. No. No, I will not. No. No, I will not kiss you. Oh, she's getting mad. Oh, oh. Careful now. She's getting angry. Come on. Yeah. I'm not giving in. Is there something I can do? Hold on. Oh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's not gonna work. Oh boy. No. Oh, yep, here we go. She's getting. Come on, let us go. そんなこと言わないで。お願いだから。お願いだから。ねえ。私に<笑> Of course I can see how desperate you are, but you've already killed me! How many times now, lady? Uh, no, I want to get out of this stock oh, bullshit. I run. Uh oh What is she doing? Oh. oh, oh no. Uh, Miyuki? Miyuki ignores me and dashes out of the out of that. She's going on a manhunt for Aoi. What's going on with her? Why did she burst into tears? Nothing she said made any sense. I decide to... Look for Aoi. Look for Aoi? That can't be right. Aoi's a video game character. No, she's not, dude. She's real. She's real. God had told us so. There's no way she exists in real life. I guess I could go look for Aoi... For an Aoi figure or an Aoi pillowcase. My dude. <laughs> Close enough. Close enough. And since Miyuki's gone, this is my one chance to get my hands on some merch. Yes, time to be a weeaboo. But that's not important right now. No, my top priority is to... Look for Aoi. Ah, god damn it. Why do I feel like this? I know I'm just wasting time. And yet, I feel this weird compulsive urge to look for Aoi. It makes absolutely no sense. But I feel compelled to do it anyway. Good, do it. Fine, whatever, let's go buy a figure, I guess. My only choice is to find Aoi as fast as possible. I take a deep breath, then head for the door. All those locks are gone. Wait, what the... My shoes are missing. My shoes are missing? 
Okay, that's an odd thing to go. Is she trying to make sure that we don't leave the house? I hastily dig through the shoe boxes in the closet and eventually I find them all the way in the back. Oh, she tried to hide them. I can't believe Miyuki went out of her way to put them all the way back here. As usual, she's a total neat freak. No, she's trying to make sure you don't leave. That's what she's doing. Okay, now I'm outside. But where do I go from here? I have no set destination in mind. Shinichi? Yutaro? Oi! Shinichi ka? Shinichi da yo na! Oh, hey, Yutaro. Perfect timing. Hey, listen. I know this is probably a weird question. Hen na koto te, ima no omae ga ichiban hen. Huh? Have you seen Aoi anywhere? Muko? Yeah, Muko Aoi. Konojo nara ore no yue ni iru kedo? Oh! Oh! What? What do you mean she's at your place? She's a video game character, isn't she? Game? What's the It's about to get tasteful. Oh, yes. What? There appears to be some kind of communication breakdown happening here. Yes, let's go. Let's go, let's go. Come on. Uh, okay. My leg? My leg? Did she make up a lie that um, she was taking care of me um, because I had a broken leg or something? Was I? Wait, what are you talking about? What? Was she lying that we was in a hospital so she could just keep her, keep us in our house? Damn! I see. Yep. Uh, mine's gone. Near enough. Need to do another shave today. I never would have recognized you. Damn. My what? Now that you mentioned it, my hair does feel pretty long. That's weird. No, no, no. No, no. At least, I don't think so. A few minutes later, we arrive at Yutaro's house. Oh yeah, because he lives in the... Yeah. Hello, Haro. Let's go! <laughs> Getting changed? She's working here part-time. Is this connected to the um, the in-game version that um, Miyuki created? The one that we played in our spare time in the beginning of this whole altered version? Is that the version that we were seeing? Oh, wonder what the heck that was. I think somebody just dropped some posting? Somebody just left the gate wide open. Oh dear. You, Chido? Once again, I can't find. I can't understand what Yutaro is saying. Oh, that, I, did I actually say that? He's pointing at Haruchan. There's no way Haruchan is Yu Chido. Yes, he is. He doesn't know us? So. Why are we still walking when we're standing on the spot? <laughs> Give me a break. We're in the same club, aren't we? Why are you acting like we'd never met? How much did Miyuki alter? <laughs> well, that's true. <laughs> I mean, I guess he has got a point there. I'm... Not in the theatre club? Haru-chan, is this true? Oh boy, my memories don't match their claims. Are they just messing with me right now? No, definitely not all. Are my memories wrong? Oh, they're definitely wrong. Hi. There she is. Just then a girl pops out from the back room, her hand raised in the air. I mean, it's possible. It's Aoi. What? 
hell is Aoi doing here? <laughs> That's not what I mean. Isn't she hella reading in the visual novel? Was the first version of the game the one that was already altered? But that wouldn't make sense, would it? She is? Hi. Unless the programming was only m messing with our memory specifically, because um, Miyuki hadn't mastered it yet, had she? She hasn't mastered reprogramming everything. Aoi raised her hand high into the air. Oh, eh? Oh, okay. Apparently Aoi wants to speak with me in private. Oh boy. <laughs> and I request I follow her outside. Out in front of the store, she turns to face me. The more I look at her, the more I'm sure of it. She's identical to her video game self. Oh, yeah. Oh, so everyone's memory was... No, 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 it's only mine, because if everyone else's memories were altered instead of mine... Well, of course, the, the real me can't have his memory changed um, of the game, because we've already experienced it, and even Miyuki knows. So, the main character is probably the only one who didn't have his memory changed, but everyone else did? Or maybe everyone did have their memories changed, henceforth why it's not adding together. Like some of the events with uh, Miyuki were fake. Mm -hmm. Find what out? Or Aoi altered? No. So she is a video game character? Five 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 zero five two three. What do you mean, how? You were right there in the game. game? She pulls out her phone. The same visual novel is on the screen, and the owie in the game looks identical to the owie right in front of me. Oh, whoa, hello. What the? Oh, this again. I look up to find dark storm clouds swirling in the sky above us where previously there had been only a sunset. Oh, boy. Oh, we're back here again. Creepy music's gonna come back. The music that made my skin crawl. Ugh. Almost like a tiny typhoon localized entirely over the school. <laughs> oh. How he takes off running. Oh! Everything's fucked. What the? How he? Where are you? <laughs> Alright, we're going to the roof of the school. Oh, no, not again. An update patch? Miyuki is doing it. <laughs> oh boy! Oh boy! Oh wow, look at that! Miyuki's words echo in my ears. I'll alter this world. I don't understand. How can I tell fact from fiction? That's a good question. Not even I can answer that. Our oh, was supposed to be a visual novel heroine. But then I saw her with my own two eyes. There's no way this is a dream. This is real life. If everything that had happened up until yesterday was all just part of a video game, and that video game will become reality, then that means Miyuki will erase Aoi from reality? Yep. Oh boy. Here we go. Fighting time. <laughs> Oh, I'm nervous. I dash out onto the roof and turn around. Standing at the center of the universe is Miyuki. There she is. Miyuki. Shinichi. Aoi mo issho na no ne. Miyuki, denwa o kaesu. De okure yo. Oh boy. How do I remove the high window? Because I know now Whenever these things go on, I have to take a screenshot. Otherwise, I'll never get the, the scene again. And I don't want to Google it for spoilers. So, I'm going to have to just uh, do that. <gasps> oh, God. is picking up. Yep. Yuki presses the call button. Yep, there we go. There's the track. Her signal transmits beyond the furthest reaches of the sky. This is the world. 
Oh, not again. <laughs> the hell is she talking about? I don't get it. I don't want to get it. But judging from everything she's saying, yep. There it is. There's the creepy la la la. Ugh. Did you trick me? She did. Yep. She gazes far into the distance. I don't understand what she's looking at. There's only one way to summon back Aoi, and we know what it is. Oh, oh, I didn't do that. Whoa, 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 whoa. Calm down, game. Yes, you did. You what? So she... So it wasn't just a normal drug, it was the one that made us hallucinate. Wow! Or distort everything. Why would you do that? Is this some kind of joke? No. Aoi struggles to support her own weight. She leans against me to stay upright. Oh yeah, she's being deleted. You're vanishing. Oh god, it looks like her eyes twitching. Oh god. Miyuki, you've got to help her. Oh. As she whispers, I realise. Her voice is emotionless, as if she doesn't even care. You can't give up that quick. This isn't right. But well, uh... This is a bad end. Damn. Jesus. The only way we can do something is by summoning her back, and that's not going to be easy. Are we? Because we're going to need that phone. Oh? A glitch? She's not fully deleted. Oh. Oh boy. A single fat tear rolls down her blank, stoic face. I'm not going to use this one. No, 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 no. I'm not going to use this one. This is too spoilerific. Nah, I'm not going to bait people. No, it's not. She remembered, didn't she? Did she just get everything? Or was that a single massive fuck you to Aoi because um, somebody forced it in there, I wonder. There it is. She has to remember that now. Damn. <laughs> oh, damn. Aoi's screw shakes the entire world. Wait, why does it say Aoi's saying that? <laughs> I'm going to go to war with Miyuki and I don't give two dabs about it. We're going to save her. 
We got gonna save her. I've already decided. She clings to me, but her words are fading fast. Yuki! Why the hell are you doing this? This is fucked up! Because <laughs> can't do this, you I am? Okay. I'm <laughs> Don't become self aware. <laughs> I place my eternal love. What is she talking about? She's all about me in the very first of this. Damn. I don't remember anything right now. I don't need to say that. Her voice is barely a whisper. It takes everything I have just to make out the voice. God damn, this is loud. Remember what? Yes, I do. I remember. Oh. Oh boy. I will. Who are you back? What are you talking? And she's gone, isn't she? I was struggling to open her mouth. She's trying to tell me something. But her voice is vanishing along with the rest of her. Her lips twitch slightly. And there we go. Aoi loves you. There it is. Update time, boys. Time to go to war. <laughs> Aoi? Aoi? Owie! My scream echoes in vain. She's just gone. I'm gonna enjoy taking you on. Is it? Is this happiness to you? Sotsuki, your acting skills won't work on me. Your voice is shaking. Yes, it is. Come on, give her the good old bitch slap, please. No head patch, a bitch slap. I quietly climb up the ladder. Miyuki averts her gaze. I walk right up to her. I don't know what to believe. I have no way to discern the truth. But there's one thing I do know. Oh, wow. Some of these images are amazing. Like, I already had loads of CGs in the space of one episode. It's pretty insane. Uh, Miyuki, step by step I approach her. Shinichi? Another step, then another. What? Am I pushing her off the roof? I will my heart not to pound out of control. Gently, I pull her close. She's telling me to push her off. Isn't she? Miyuki closes her eyes. And I snatch the phone out of her hand. Oh! Time to make a run for it. Quick, while she still has her eyes closed. I'll run until she can't find me anymore. Come on! Come on! <laughs> Here we go! As I apologize internally to Miyuki. I bolt full speed down the stairs. Oh dear. <laughs> I didn't trick you for the fun of it, believe me. But... Come on! Miyuki erased her from reality. I don't know what happened or how she was able to do it in the first place, but I can't just let it slide. Miyuki is messed up. Yes, she is. But she's an old friend of mine and my girlfriend, which means I had to be the one to fix this. Where is she? Oh, I can hear the footstep in the corridor. Uh oh. I'll pass, thanks. Yeah, same here. Now to leave the school. It's locked, isn't it? I know these doors were open when I came in. But now they're all closed for some reason. Oh, I'm being hunted. She made sure I couldn't run. She'd done that in the update. Sure there is. If I can't get through this front, I'll just have to... 
<laughs> Where is she? This can't be right. I'm feeling like my life depends on it. But she's not even out of breath. How? She upgraded herself to be like a god. How did she catch up to me so easily? I dash through my twisted world, clutching Miyuki's phone in my hand. But I can't escape. Dial the number, god damn it! Ooh, now this is uh, atmospheric. The back entrance, the gym, the connecting corridor. They're all locked up tight. And the windows won't open either. There's no way out. What is that? Oh. Oh, God. That's impossible, isn't it? Sure enough, I'm trapped here. Miyuki's voice finds me no matter where I go. I have no sense of distance anymore. No matter where I run, I can practically see Miyuki looming up ahead. No. <laughs> oh boy. I hastily turn back. Miyuki doesn't seem to be in the slightest hurry, and yet she beats me to the punch every time. At this rate, I'll never escape her. Call the number. Yeah, come on! Pull out the phone, dude! And I remember it. I'm glad I remember it as well. That's it. I don't need to run. My objective is to bring Aoi back to reality. So I just need to buy some time until I can make a phone call. A half-open door catches my eye. I dash into the classroom and carefully close the door so it doesn't make a sound. She knows where you are, dude! This isn't our classroom. It's a first-year classroom, one that I've never set foot in. Now that I'm in here, Miyuki shouldn't be able to see me. Which means I should have time to call out. No. It's no use. It's no use. Miyuki's footsteps persist. How? How does she know what floor I'm on? It's almost like she knows where I'll go in advance. Yes, she knows. She's programmed it so she understands exactly what- She's controlling where we're going! But not the choices that we make with her. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Wait, what am I doing? I don't have time to worry about that. Hide behind the teacher's lectern and take out Miyuki's phone. Before she disappeared, she told me to use her code number. And that number is... Come on. 555. Five, five. Five 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 zero five two three. Please work. <sighs> no, you're kidding me. The words leave my lips unbidden, but I should have expected this. After all, I don't know what code number Ali was talking about. I got it wrong. No 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 no. I read it down. I read it down. Hold on one minute. I did not write it down. I did write it down. What am I on about? Sorry about that. I tripped over my own microphone and I've pretty badly damaged the port. So now I'm going to have to be careful with my microphone now because I actually tripped on the wire and it just it's damaged the actual headphone port on the microphone. So I'm going to have to be extra careful with it from now on. And I realised I got the code wrong. It's 999-0523-0523. I know people are going to be yelling at me for that. I'm sorry. <laughs> and she's found me, hasn't she? <laughs> oh, damn it. Oh, damn it. I didn't forget the birthday, I just got the beginning bit wrong. Miyuki? I feel like this is the first time in my life I've ever seen Miyuki so jubilant. I know what it is. It's 999-0523-0523. Miyuki takes the phone and holds it in an angle so I can watch her punch in the numbers she just told me. She hits the call button, but... It wouldn't have worked anyway. It wouldn't have worked anyway. The call won't go through. 
Where? Where? It's been cut off, hasn't it? Wait. What do you mean? What do you mean? あなたの居場所が分かったのも... Oh, we described it. No wonder that makes sense. Backlog. Makes sense. The heck is a backlog? What on earth is she even talking about? Is there really no way I can bring back bring Aoi back? Is there no way to save Miyuki? Damn it! God damn it! Ah, oh, damn it! I fucked it up. And also broke my damn freaking microphone at the same time. Good God. あなたの意思なんて関係ないの。あなたはずっとずっと永遠に。なあだわな。私のこの世界の中で生きていくの。ずっとずっとね。I don't want to live here, Miki. Oh no, we're here again. Oh no, move away. She made it so I can't do anything. I tried to pull my hand away, but she grabs it. No. Oh, what a fun day. We're back to this again. And I can't do anything. Huh? Wait, my back cut, cuts through empty air. I guess I... I guessed correctly, and yet still she succeeded my every expectation. Did she beat me in the batting cages as well? You've gotten good. I'm sure you put in a lot and you remember last time. Good point. I can't begin to imagine. Okay, what do you want me to do? Is she gonna force a kiss, isn't she? Suddenly she leans in. That is not a kiss. That is something more explicit, might I say. Whoa there, hold on a minute. Eh? <laughs> we can't. Damn, she's a kinky psychopath. <laughs> Wait. No, that wasn't. She's bored with the normal type of fun, let's say. <laughs> well, uh... <laughs> Jeez. Cosplay. How about doing it in cosplay? I mean, even though many people outside of Japan have this sort of role-playing thing, I mean, it's kind of the same as cosplay in a way with this sort of thing because it's got that role-play element. I mean, not super, but since you said you wanted to spice things up... Oh, um, I don't want to be in a I don't for real? ちょっとなのはさすがに嫌かな。おいや、ふくろ。she moves in close and gently kisses me, and I'm sure a bit more than that. 
Ah, oh, what a fun day to skip. Oh, actually. Memories, there we go. Um, it looks like I'm gonna have to do this game again. Alright. Now loading, okay? Okay. I'm talking about Harijan, obviously. I mean, she confessed I love to you, didn't she? だから、あれは俺の勘違いだったんだって。いや、しょ。てかさ、兄弟だぞ、兄弟。普通にありえないし。ちょ、ウェイ、ブラザーアンセスター。ウェイ。ウェイ、ウェイ、ウェイ、
Not two, but one. It's just sitting there all by its lonesome. The price is about what I was expecting, yeah. Oh well, Miyuki really seems to like it, so... Want me to buy it for you? You want it, don't you? Ah, God's sake, sure it will. I grab it and hurry over to the rich dad. We already know we get it for her. Oh no, can't run again. Uh, come on, give me something else. Give me something else. Uh, at the bookstore. We've done the show down at the batting cages at least, so we're near enough halfway through them. Cat owner's manual. Cat owner's manual. Well, you like cats, don't you? Oh, right. Uh, maybe I shouldn't have bought this. Um, I mean, I could be trying to kill her. <laughs> Considering what she's done so far. Oh, no, not this one again. Why is it sh Why can't it just vary them out, you know? A mysterious cardboard box we've already seen. Show down the back cages. Study session. Let's do that one. Let's see if we can get the phone. Let's see if we can get the phone. Because this is the one where we was able to get it, right? with it. Since curiosity has gotten better at me. Address book. Right when I try to open her address book, the lock screen appears. It's a fingerprint lock. Damn it! I test it on my index finger, but actually my finger is, is rejected. She made sure to lock the phone. Damn! I see there's an unlock via security questions option, but Miyuki will be back any minute. So I put the phone back on the table and go back to doing my homework like a good boy. Damn it! So we need to figure out the password. Oh, hold on. Oh, it's still that one. It's uh, it's the one from before. Okay. Um, cutting class. Let's see how this one just changed now. I like the pleasant music now, but goddamn, the fact that I have no choice makes me feel a bit nervous. Not gonna lie. Fine, you win. <laughs> Say like that, but you're happy. I mean, I guess I don't mind skipping. Mm -hmm. It isn't? No, I'm not. Feels like we're having two different conversations here. Still, Miyuki looks pretty happy now that I've agreed to skip with her. Dang it. Shoulder to shoulder, we stare out over the town. This is the sort of view you could find just about anywhere, really. The sky serves as a backdrop. The sun shines down from above. The clouds blow past like someone shifting them around in an image editing program. <laughs> oh, if only you knew the half of it. Then the distance... Oh, god damn it. That's why I pressed up. That's why that came up. Got it. Our fellow classmates in the courtyard. You trying to say I'm stupid? Damn. Yeah, maybe I am stupid. Once I graduate, I figure I'll pursue higher education. But after that, who knows? What do I want to be? What do I want to be of my life? It doesn't feel real. I can't imagine I'll ever leave this town. Mm. I'm sure you would say that. Yuki rests her head on my shoulder. Aren't you going to try to make your acting debut? Why not? Let me guess, you still want to be a mecha pilot? <laughs> Get in the back, Shinji. How could I forget, really? <laughs> no, but seriously, though, what are your plans? Knowing you, you've got to have some sort of long-term goal, yeah? Well, yeah, of course. Uh, we're here, and she's keeping us uh, host hostage, so yeah. There it is. <laughs> Very funny. Well, the take care of you part has already been done several times, so I don't disbelieve it. I look up at the sky. Feel like the clouds are stuck in an infinite loop animation. They are. <laughs> Like if somebody idled on this screen, if time itself came to a stop, the sky would probably keep on shifting. Talk about a bad case of Gamer Brain. Interesting now that we have Gamer Brain, isn't it? Uh, huh? Oh no, we're gonna change the picture. 
Are we going to permanently it? erase that picture? No. Or are we going to recognize something? Uh, what? Why? Uh, because... I told you, I don't really like having my photo taken. Oh, are we going to see how much of a beard in our hair has gone freaking scruffy, are we? Miyuki stacks her empty lunch containers on top of each other. What are you doing? What for? She's permanently changing that picture to make it make sense to us. Damn, couldn't we just take a selfie? Nah, there's a reason. I said I don't want to. Oh, hey! My protests are overwritten by Miyuki's surprisingly sweet smile. Right, and she specifically mentions a third person for a reason. Are we gonna see it? Alright, that's a hint for the end, isn't it? God damn. Uh, if the world disappears, I'm pretty sure you're screwed. Regardless, Miyuki seems dead serious about this. No, we don't even see facial hair or anything, like what was said before. That's interesting. Why? Because um, Yutaro said we had it before, unless she changed it so we didn't have it? That's the other alternative I can think of. Alright, come on. Happy birthday time. Happy birthday. I always feel like I'll wake up and it'll all be gone. Feels like I'll wake up and it'll be gone. Yuki's lips curl in a wicked grin. Sweetness of the cake. Oh, dang. Hold on. I decided to wear a maid. Oh, yeah. We well, mentioned about the um, maid uniform before. Yuki. Just Okay. Oh my god, she's actually going to wear it. Yuki dashes out of the room. I have a feeling I know where this is going. Mm -hmm. The room falls silent, and while I'm left to my thoughts, I hear a faint noise coming from the other room. Is she... taking her clothes off? 100%. I swallow hard. There's no doubt about it. In my birthday present, she... She's going to... We're finally going to see the maid uniform. Made a safe reaches around the corner into the room. Damn it! I've <laughs> been cocked off by the lights. <laughs> and turns off the light. Uh, what's the point of turning the lights off? Let me see, damn it, woman. <laughs> Okay, but then what's the point of putting it on in the first place? Do you want to? Do you want me to see you in it or not? <laughs> well, I'm fuming. <laughs> I said to Miyuki, approach. Yes, I'm very unhappy. I cannot see this present. I can see her silhouette in the dim light from my digital watch. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Well, there. <laughs> okay. <laughs> What did she trip on? I really think we should turn the lights back. Damn it! My present? I feel her sit beside me on the couch. The cushions sink with the addition of her weight. Mm -hmm, I'm sure. Oh. I can feel her inches away from me in the darkness. And she's probably in a maid outfit. Surely anyone would be a little flustered in our shoes. Well, yeah. <clears throat> I don't know him. Yuki clears her throat. Of course he's in summer. There it is. Now she's even talking like a maid. <laughs> Oh, oh, spicy. <laughs> oh, yeah, um, I have no objections, um, Miss Maid. Yes. 
なんだか声が苦しそうに聞こえます私がその苦しみを解いて差し上げましょうか Well then <laughs> A whisper sends a shudder rippling through my body I wanted to 前に何があったかなんて関係ないですよあなたは新しい世界にいます You bitch もう一回最初から愛し合いたいんです愛し合いたいってだから<笑>気持ちに素直になってください、uh, I guess I'll have to do as she asks Please come for me Oh goodness what the heck was that Don't know what the hell just happened with my camera then Sorry about that guys Good god What the heck was that I might be down from broken everything now Jesus Very well in that case She takes a breath. Though it's too dark to see, I can tell she's bowing deeply. Why is there no dialogue now? That's weird. That's weird that there's no dialogue. Weird. Why is that changed now? I feel her lean forward. And then her lips touch mine. That was weird. Why are some of the audio lines not there? That is, um, that's very well translated, that bit. Damn. <laughs> oh boy. Alright, I'm going to blast through the next few memories, and then after that, I think I'll end off the episode. I've not had the greatest start to recording back, nearly breaking my microphone, and my camera is acting up. Why? I don't know. I'm probably going to have to take the camera off if it's going to do that, because that's, that's not good. At all. Alright, come on. Oh, come on, come on. You oh, uh, I'll cook this time. Kick her out, nah. Oh, oh, we got something. Great, thanks. Yours are. Yours is not hard to make. Although you have to be very careful when you're doing it with your hands when you uh, make the ribbing on the um, on the pastry. Because otherwise, you're going to mess it up. It's, it might be too greasy and then it won't taste as nice. I tried. Leave me alone. Shut up. I'll show you. I'm not a little kid anymore. Yes, yes. I'm Oh boy. Ah, I made a good dinner. This is really delicious. I may have done. Maybe. Eh? That wasn't one. I don't know. 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 I don't know how she could say that with a straight face, uh -huh. face at all. Oh, no. Be right back. Yep. Yuki shoots me a teasing grin as I head into the kitchen. I open the fridge and pull out a carton of strawberries. As I uh, as payback, I'm going to make a favorite dessert. Crush up the strawberries, then pour some cream over them. Yes, pour the cream all over it. And lastly, add some sugar. Eh? Looks like the sugar bowl is empty. Where does she keep it again? Down here? I put a cup of bar- Oh! Her secret ingredient! Inside is a large paper bag marked sugar in red letters. As well as a smaller unlabeled paper bag. I reach out and grab- Wait, which one was the smaller one? Um, 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 um. 
back lot. It's a... Grab the unlabeled paper bag. Yes, grab the small bag. Grab the small bag. Pick up the small paper bag. Whatever it is, something inside me is telling me I need to use it. Some sort of inner instinct. Once I refill the sugar bowl with its contents, I scoop up the fat sp <laughs> Are we about to freaking overdose her? <laughs> Sprinkle all over the strawberries. There, all done. <laughs> I know, I know, I'm coming. I'm gonna drug you, bitch. I grab the bowl of strawberries and cream and carry it back to her. Sorry I took so long. Here's your dessert. Oh boy. It's your favourite, right? And I've used a small bag that I didn't even know about. You're very welcome. Is this my way out? She must really like that stuff. She hasn't even finished her main course and she's already moved on to dessert. Does it not work now? Oh, really? Yes, I made the wrong call. Using that small paper bag. I was hoping the secret ingredient would make up for it. Of course. No. <laughs> Oh, shut up. How can you even say that cheesy crap with a straight face? No problem. Looks like my dessert scrapes by with passing marks. Relieved I take the seat at the table and reach for my chopsticks. Well then, that's that. Time to get back to my... Yuki? Yuki? After me, Yuki. <laughs> yeah, maybe you should lie down on the sofa. Miyuki? Before I can even finish my sentence, Miyuki leans back against the sofa and begins to snore quietly. Maybe she's had a really long day today. I gently lay a blanket over Wait, we could grab her phone now. Use her fingerprint to unlock the phone and use it. We can do that. We can do that. Moments later, Miyuki falls into a deep sleep. She must have been even more exhausted than she let on. Take the phone and do her fingerprint, you fool! Night falls and she's still out like a light. Somehow I get the feeling I could probably get away with just about anything tonight. There it is. Oh boy. Um, I can't save, can I? I cannot save. I'm going to have to keep going. I, I'm going to have to. Unless I have to do this um, again to get back to it. Because otherwise this video is going to last forever. So we know what we have to do, at the very least, to get to this point. Which is awesome. We've made progress. We found our opportunity to get into that phone to bring back Aoi. And she plainly outlined the number for us as well, even though I put it in like an idiot. But it's not like it would have made a difference anyway. And also I've now damaged my mic. So I'm, of course, very happy about that. Yes. Shite. Well, anyway, that is going to do it for this episode of Yumi and her love story. So, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Leave a like if you did. Subscribe if you want any more from me. And I shall see you in the next video. So, guys. I will most certainly see you next time. Oh, boy. Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. This is progress, lads.